all I got is Lexi. If you haven't watched the Bullock housing tour video, then go ahead and click on that right now to watch it because that is a prerequisite before watching this video. So about two, three, a month ago, um, they moved my whole class to this brand new hotel on post. It's called Candlewood Suites. I don't know if you can read that right there, but it's a very, very, very nice hotel. It's actually an upgrade. I never showed y'all the tour of my room, so let's just get into that right now. So as you all can see, this room is clearly an upgrade from my first hotel that I moved in when I first checked in to Bullock. I'm very happy to be here. Also, I'm looking at this picture. Um, it's a railroad, which is irrelevant. But at the last hotel, they had a picture of cotton. So this is an upgrade too. So now let's get into life at Bullock and what you can expect if you're going to Bullock in 2020. So my life at Bolick is similar to this desk behind me, a hot mess. I am halfway through Signal Bolick at Fort Gordon, Georgia and um, this is quite the experience, you know. Before coming to Bolick, of course, I did my research trying to see what it was going to be like but never in a million years I think I would be coming to Bolick during a pandemic. Never in a million years did I think a pandemic would happen in my lifetime or in my young, young part of my lifetime anyway. All that research was basically a waste. Not in a bad way, but like nobody could prepare me for this. Nobody even could prepare the text, which is like our cadre, which is like our teachers. Nobody could pre prepare them for this. Nobody could prepare the general for this. Like nobody knows what's going on. So as y'all saw in that little sequence of clips, um, that's basically my everyday, Monday through Friday. I do my own PT by myself because we have to do it on our own and then go to class online, listen to the lecture and usually have a test about a week after the first day of a certain teaching period. What I do hate is that like, I mean of course with everyone else in the world who's young and wants to go out, well, some of y'all are young and are going out, but that's not me. So for the ones that are actually being cautious and are young and want to go out, like, we feel each other's pain, right? Because Bolick, what I've been told in the past is basically, <laughs> I don't want to say anything crazy, but basically like college again, because you're going to class and we have weekends off. So we litty on the weekend, but yeah, we cannot do that here as far as 
my specific bolic um we have all of our classes online literally there's no hands-on anything but they still have our ftx scheduled for the week before we graduate don't know how that's gonna work because clearly we've already had cases within our class including myself so y'all trying to mitigate the risks or y'all don't care and just trying to check the block for our graduation what's what are we doing here if y'all been watching my videos you know that like i have a an excel spreadsheet of all the videos i want to make and i did it all like in advance way in advance i planned it based off of where i was going to be in that month what i was going to be doing so for this video i was supposed to give y'all tips for bolic if you're going to signal bolic specifically but it's really not much I could tell y'all because this world that we live in today, in 2020, it might not be the same in 2021. It might not be the same next month. Literally, we don't know what's going on and that's really crazy. What I can give y'all are general expectations that you can prepare for, for should be any bolic really. So number one, freedom. Coming from ROTC and prior enlisted in the guard, I am so used to being told what to do, what time, how to do, what I was told to do, like, but here, like, I'm an officer. That's crazy. That still blows my mind to me. It still blows my mind when people salute me. But anyway, on the first day, of course, like, we're, of course, we're still told what to do, but like, to a certain extent, like, they trust you to get it done and you got to get it done period because that's what you're getting paid to do as an officer and when it comes to resolving problems that's also what you're paid to do like you are the brain behind the army you make things happen just like that another example of freedom that you get in bolic is of course having your car if you're enlisted you went to ait so you already know how it went back there there are definitely no cars allowed at AIT. Even if you like live close to where you're going to AIT, you can bring your car, I think, but they store it somewhere. You can't drive it. So it, it's no freedom for the enlisted and it's a lot of freedom for us. Another thing that you might want to be prepared for at Bow Lake is possible pay issues. So unfortunately, I had pay issues. Um, so right now we are halfway through Bolick and I just now started getting paid like one week ago, maybe a week and a half. And I really just found it to be quite absurd because y'all have people in processing here all the time. So how does it take that long to process some papers? And that's the other thing. I had to fill out those papers twice, the same papers with the exact same information. I'm like... What happened to my original papers? Who's not doing their job? So really, I, I just had to keep my foot on their neck because I don't play about getting paid. I was literally calling my S1 like every day. Well, at first I was going in the office and then I caught COVID, so I had to be on lockdown. So I was just calling from there. Sometimes I didn't even answer. I feel like they, they know me on a personal basis now all right so i wanted to leave this off on a positive note i did think of other things you see, you should expect but that might just have to be another video because they're all negative so positively another thing that you should expect at bullock is to make a few connections there will be plenty of officers from different walks of life in your class so do not be afraid to go out and talk to them. Get to know your classmates. If you're still in a pandemic during Bullock like I am, then it might be quite difficult. I've been here for two months, like I said, and I don't hate anyone. I don't dislike anyone. I just, I'm only cool with a couple, but that's that's just anywhere I go. I'm a, I'm a only be cool with a couple. I'm not gonna be cool with the whole crowd. But I do know like the basics besides people's names i know i do know like where they're coming from so some people are prior enlisted active some people are going to be in the guard when they leave here you know i know i know that stuff and then the ones i'm cool with we cool so those are a couple of expectations you should look forward to going to Bolick. please make sure y'all are continuing to be safe we ain't got time for no more cases i know the numbers 
spiking it down and it's spiking it down. I mean, just be smart, y'all, please. I hope y'all enjoyed the new room tour and I hope y'all got something out of my expectations. If you want another video going more in depth of Bolick, then I will probably make one after I leave because then I'll have like all the knowledge I can tell y'all everything. Just let me know, comment down below. If you're going to Signa Bullet, if you're going to Bullet period 2020, when do you commission? Are you in ROTC? Are you just watching just to watch? Let me know. Well, I'll see y'all in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.